not just Niagara Falls. It's in the path of the total solar eclipse. Hamilton is as well. And Hamilton Mayor Andrea Horvath joins us with more on what the city has planned for viewing. Before we get to that, though, mm -hmm. let's go online uh, for an update for the uh, cybersecurity incident. Sure. I mean, we're working away at the rebuild, uh, trying to get everything back in place. Uh, one of the most recent um, achievements, I guess we can say, is we're back to, um, uh, we figured out how to make sure that people's, people who are, uh, have their um, pre-authorized payment for their taxes, those payments didn't come out for March and April. So we've just kind of figured out how to make sure that that happens in a schedule to prevent people from all of a sudden having everything come out at once and mm -hmm. so it's yeah so that's that's the that's one of our latest achievements so but we're we're just working away at it and it's taking time and effort we're back to the normal schedule though for our committee meetings and council meetings and uh, and those pieces but I mean there are still challenges I I wouldn't want to pretend that it was all kosher now and everything was tickety boo it's not the case but we're working hard okay Okay, now let's look for brighter things. Well, hopefully, if, oh, hopefully the, brighter. <laughs> if the sun shines this afternoon, there are a number of spots within the city of Hamilton. Yeah, well, the, first and foremost, we say to people, if you have a local community park, a big backyard, you don't even have to go anywhere, except you do have to wear the glasses. Mm -hmm. So that's the big, big caution, is you, you can't look at the sun uh, at the eclipse without those glasses on. Uh, but we also have uh, larger viewing areas, uh, you know, pr predominantly for visitors, but people are welcome to, to come. Uh, the biggest one, of course, is Tim Hortons Field, or the most kind of organized one in terms of space. Mm -hmm. uh, but um, we also have uh, Bayfront Park, Pier 4 Park, TB McQuestion Park. Which is up on the mountain by Lime Ridge, mountain, yeah. yeah. And um, the Confederation Beach Park. And at all of those locations, except Tim Hortons Field, uh, we will have excess glasses that we are still giving out. So if people want glasses, they don't have them yet, you can show up there at like, 12.30 and, and you can pick up a, a pair of last minute glasses. Uh, at uh, Not at Tim Hortons Field, though. There won't be people there to distribute at that time. Okay, and I understand, was Tim Hortons Field, is it already full at capacity? Yes, it's already at capacity. Okay, yeah. okay. So and it's a ticketed. An outside, yeah. an outside venue then. But I mean, we have so many beautiful viewing spots to begin with, right? Oh yeah, any park, any place, any open space that you are at, even as I said, people can watch from their backyards. It's, uh, you don't have to go to a viewing location, but what mm -hmm. you do have to do is, is be safe. So the, the locations that I talked about opening around uh, two and one thirty, and um, we're asking people to show up early. Yeah, what about parking? Uh, well, it, the parking would be what's normally available. Okay. Uh, we, we're really encouraging people to take public transit. Mm -hmm. uh, that's that's even people who are coming from further away. If you're coming from the Toronto area to to hop on the GO train and and take uh, buses in, uh, that's that's what we're recommending. Right. Because if you take the GO train in, then I mean you you've got a great spot right there at well, Bayfront Park. Right, right there at Bayfront Park. You're right. Yep. Okay. What about um, special resources? Anything coming in? Because I I've heard that there's like going to be an extra 100,000 people expected. Yeah, well, and we are, so we're, that's why we identify these locations so that people, so it's organized, mm -hmm. people know where to go, uh, and uh, they'll be able to get the glasses there, so they'll be viewing in a safe way. Um, in, in terms of, the, there's always going to be the, the required amount of uh, uh, security folks around because of crowd control and those kinds of things, yeah. but I, I would hope that uh, people are all in this for the fun of it, and uh, and and the uniqueness of it, right? It's 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 a pretty unique experience, and as we know, Hamilton will not have it again for 120 years. And so, you know, let's all go and hope hope for this sun. This is Brian's job. Hope yeah. for the sun to, <laughs> to come oh, out. so much Sorry, pressure Brian. just a few <laughs> meters away from I us, know. right? <laughs> Everybody's asking. Yeah, Everybody's know. asking. Okay, where are you going to be watching from? Uh, I'm going to go to Tim Hortons Field. Okay. Yeah. Very cool. Yeah. All right. So we'll get uh, again all of those um, all those viewing spots uh, up on our website chch.com. Mayor Andrea Horvath, thanks for joining us again. My pleasure.